It was Brom's day for exploring the big town. He was brum, brum, brumming his way along the pavements, past the fire station, when what do you think happened? <laughs> Oh dear. Sorry, Brom, said the fireman. <coughs> Looks like we owe you a car wash. Never been so clean. Thank you, he said. Always glad to help, said the fireman. Bye! And off Brum went all squeaky clean. Then what do you think he saw? A big bunch of shining new balloons. They look nice, he thought. And he wasn't the only one. saved up all her pocket money to buy some. There you go, said the balloon seller. Wait for me, said Brom, and he set off after her. But what do you think? There were two bored children with nothing much to do. Let's see your balloon, said one. Let's see your doll, said the other. Leave her alone, said Brom. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> Go of her doll. Okay, they said. Away flew the doll higher and higher. Oh dear. The big children didn't care. They thought it was funny. But Brum knew just what to do. See what I can do. But when he got to the top of the building, Brum began to feel funny. But just then, guess who came along? The firemen were out for a practice run. Look up there, said one. It's Brum, shouted his friend, on the roof. He's trying to get my dolly back, said the little girl. Leave this to us, said the fireman. Brom, you shouldn't be up here, said the fireman. It's a good thing we came along.
Thanks, Brum, said the little girl. And don't you ever go up there again, Brum, said the fireman. I won't, not ever. See you, said Brum. Surf and right, thought Brum. Brummed happily all the way home. <laughs> <laughs>